Hi guys, it's Lego Yoshi and welcome back to my playthrough of Mario Party 3 where we have just done Woody Woods again. And this is the final result screen, so hopefully I will win. It all depends. I should think I should be alright. As far as I know, I've got the minigame star, so as long as I've got one star, I should be fine. I think Wario's got the coin star, and possibly he's got the hacking star as well. Maybe DK got it, but. Also, I know this is the start of a new video as well, so but I thought this might be a bit easier and I can get straight on with the uh, dual map board after this. So, first look at the stars collected. Uh, 4, 2, 1, 0. The coins, Wario's got 97. The new game started me. Times, I've got now at least. So, this went a lot better than the other one. And I got a bit of luck along the way as I got a hidden, hidden block near the start of the game. And then one star spawned which was two spaces away from me. Uh, but it all did come down to last turn as I had to... I knew Mario was going to be catching up and I thought he might have the uh, coin star and the happy star. And um, the item mini game on the 14th turn, I actually managed to get a magic lamp, so that helped. So, so anyway, the other thing as well is I got a lot of um, new mini games in that playthrough, which I'm not happy about because I wanted to save them. Which it's not going to be a problem anyway, but it's still a little bit infuriating when the last time we did this we got the shirt off here. And detailed results that you for you. The uh, mini game I completely dominated. Uh, most coins held, yep. Dickel and most blues, Luigi and most reds, Wario land on four happening spaces. Uh, DK land on one chance time, which gave him a star from Luigi. Uh, Wario land on one Bowser. And three of us land on one battle space, which was all in one turn, which was interesting. Uh, I land on most happening spaces, Wario land on the bank, and uh, I land on one game guy space, which I actually won. It was uh, Game Guy Magic Boxes. So we'll continue with that. Uh, yep, yeah, I'll probably get an 8 one for that, but I'm not doing too bad. Save it from there. And place the data. Let me turn my lights off so I can get that recording. You'll, you've overcome yet again, Yoshi. Now I shall give you the love star stamp. I wonder who's gonna suddenly appear. Hmm. Who shouted me? No, you're not. Hey, Timbo! How about I show you how I can be the love star by taking you back to my castle and the uh, oh shit they can hear me. Oh crap. <clears throat> when you speak of love, you speak of peach. So shouldn't the love star be mine? That's what she's saying. Tumble's voice has probably changed about three times. <laughs> what shall we do? Hmm, I wonder. Could he hit us inside the head again? Yep. Oh, we're going to go to a dual map known as Blowhard, which is uh, appropriate for Peach, isn't it? Okay, I'll stop with the horrible jokes now. But anyway, let's go to the dual map. Now, Blowhard can actually be over very quickly, so I'm not 100% sure how this is going to go yet. Play the little star when we play on Blowhard, a map that blows partners around. Challenger. <laughs> That's a lie. I love everyone and everything, except Lego Yoshi. Finally, let's go to the rules. The story mode, the number of turns, sets to turns, the handicap option is off. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Blowhard. 
Uh, don't follow his name seriously. Well, there's plenty of jokes out there that people's gonna be having right now. Okay. So, is he gonna actually do it properly this time, or is he gonna? Yes, he did. Yoshi's gonna go first, and then Peach. Yeah, Beach has Toad, which is no surprise there. Toad doesn't do much good damage and health, but he is very cheap, and he can help you just not lose coins, which is... It does actually make him one of the better characters in the game, to be fair to Take this peach. Get out of my way. Now if she gets less than three, I'll be happy. <laughs> so she'll get one damage on me, but it's not going to one damage. And she's leaving herself wide open. And we'll get another attack here. Surely it couldn't be three in a row. <laughs> That's happened before, but it's not very often. Time uh, players come here, blow hard blows up, boost up wind upwards, push to the position of the player's partners. The four junctions also provide easy access to the opponent or the start space. This is the only dual map not to have any reverse spaces. In story mode, you have to dual peach or Luigi if peach is a bit new, and the board will all start spam. Alright, we want to get some new attack, we've got two. Down and then down again. So I could 
have to come back round to switch uh, one bundle back over. There we go. Right, let's go. Now, spaces on this board. Uh, there's 13 basic spaces, 2 power spaces, 2 mini game spaces, 3 happy spaces, and 6 game guy spaces. It's a bit ridiculous if you ask me, but oh well. And it's going to start once you're done. Uh, total number of spaces is 26. Uh, the names of other languages is both. In Japanese, it is known as Fancom, which is pretty much Fancom. Uh, in French, it is known as Ventilator. I'm guessing it's just going to be a ventilator. Uh, in German, it's known as Post Party, which is known as Blowing Party, which... Who thought of some of these names? Seriously. Let me show you what love is, Peach. Die! Power up bow attack. Donk. And... Yep. She is done. Spaces. Oh god, you break. And she landed on most happy spaces and most mini game spaces. We landed on more power space and the land on game guy on other spaces. And then, there we go. We should get an S rank for that one. So we only need two more S ranks from uh, four. And we will have the uh, best, best rating. Quite good. Uh, place the data, yes. Leave it there. See you later, guys. <laughs> 